Hi, it's Chris from Chris Bottrell Photography here. Again, we are going to be moving on from our last tutorial, uh, which was converting your footage from log to rec 709. Um, in this tutorial, we're going to do exactly the same, but we're going to do a very quick film grade. So we will start in our very, very first node here, and we will do our primary correction. Um, so let's bring our lift down to the bottom line. So you want it just to be touching. You can adjust it later if you need be. And then our gain, we will bring all the way up. Now what I like to do um, is create a new node. And what we'll do is we'll just introduce some contrast into the image. Contrast it up a little bit, stretch that image even more. Now on a, a new node, we're going to introduce some saturation into the image. So down here you can just use the saturation slider like so. Add a little bit of saturation in. That's cool. Um, now the next stage after we've done our um, our primaries is we can come in and actually start working on our on our secondaries, our, our actual grade. So Alt S new node, and what what are we looking at here? So exposure wise, everything's looking pretty good. Um, skin tones may be a tiny bit saturated. So what we'll do is we will come down to uh, our curves and we will choose uh, hue versus saturation. So hue is color, saturation is obviously saturation. So we we'll use our little uh, little stopper here and we will just pull that down up slightly just to, just to desaturate it a tiny, tiny little bit. Now I think, um, I think next we want to introduce uh, a little bit of film grain. So Alt S new node. I uh, come into uh, open effects and we will search for grain. So we'll come down and uh, bung some film grain on here. Uh, we want to use 35 millimeter grain. Click uh, this overlay so it's grain only so you can see exactly what your grain pattern's like. Uh, you can strengthen it up a little bit. See what that looks like. You may not be able to see it on uh, on your screens very well with uh, YouTube compression, but I can assure you it is there. Uh, I mean, to me, this this image is, is is starting to look okay, but it's I think it's just a little bit bright in places. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my gain down. I'm going to bring my darks down just a little, little tiny bit, like so. Uh, and the finishing touches um, to any film look is obviously going to be cinema bars or film bars. So if we go to timeline and go to output blanking, and we'll use 2.4. There you go. How easy was that? Film look in under, oh, I don't know how long we've been recording for, but yes. Not bad. So uh, join me soon where I'm going to be doing um, lots and lots of reviews. I'm going to be uh, reviewing the Canon C200, going to be reviewing the new um, Blackmagic Pocket 6K, uh, as well as uh, battery options for charging. Um, also going to be reviewing uh, hard drives for the Pocket 6K. Uh, uh, as well as microphones, uh, battery options, all sorts of stuff. So um, if you like these tutorials, obviously like and subscribe and I will see you soon.